There's a piece of my heart that's always here. I come here and I have a lot of reflection and nostalgia and, and genuine joy because some of my dearest friends and mentors, I found them because I came to the University of Arkansas. Two experiences at the university created the seeds for Beasts of Prey. The first was a course I took called Political Violence. What I learned is the ideas of good and evil can be so easily manipulated based on who has power and who tells the story. And then I studied abroad in Ghana as part of my degree in African and African American Studies and wondered why there are not fantasy books that had that setting and why there weren't fantasy books that had people who looked like me in them. And those two things came together and shortly after I graduated, I started writing Beasts of Prey. When I get the chance to talk to students especially, but really anyone, what I emphasize is don't give up on your dreams. It took me five years to write my first book. I'm so glad that I didn't give up on it, and I'm so glad I had good people around me to encourage me. I came to the University of Arkansas with a lot of uncertainty, and having professors who said, no, I see that you have talent, and I see you have something to contribute very early on really created a foundation and allowed me to believe in myself. Having professors that took me seriously really meant a lot to me, to feel seen and to feel valued and to feel appreciated.